Welcome to part 17 of the Autodesk Inventor 101 The Basics series. In this quick video, we'll be taking a look at the coil command and the various options included to manipulate coil size and pitch. We'll start by creating a sketch of a half inch diameter circle, which will be used as the diameter of the coiled part, followed by a 10 inch long line, which we'll use to wrap the coil around. Dimension the circle to be one inch below the line and then finish the sketch. From the Create panel on the ribbon, choose the Coil command. Much like other commands that we've looked at, you'll start by choosing the profile, in this case the circle, and then the path for it to follow, the 10 inch long line. A preview of the resulting geometry will appear on the screen. In the Coil Size tab, you can play around with the options like Pitch, which controls how far apart the revolutions will be, Revolutions, which is, well, how many revolutions will be created, and taper, which will allow the coil to become wider the further it goes. With a pitch of 1 and the revolution set to 10, press OK and your geometry will be finished. That's it! Join me again for the next episode of Autodesk Inventor 101 The Basics, where we'll take a look at creating threads with Autodesk Inventor.